Hey guys, welcome back to Campbell Workshop. Today we are going to make helenium, which is also known as sneeze weed. But don't worry, our sneeze weed is sneeze free. Before we start, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, don't forget to click on the subscribe button below so you won't miss any of our new tutorials. Let's begin. These are what you need for this project. Prepare the brown crepe paper in the following dimension. For the flower center, put a 2 times 5 cm strip aside. We are not going to color this strip. Give the paper a stretch. Fold the paper and color the paper tip with some yellow acrylic. Wait them to dry. In the meantime, we are going to cut some fringes. This time we would like to have shorter fringes. Try not to cut over 5mm. We will start with the 2 times 5 cm and cut the rest. Make a loop on the wire and attach the 2 times 5 cm paper strip with hot glue. Then we wrap the 2 times 10 cm onto the flower center. If you like to make a bigger flower with a bigger flower center, you can add the paper according to the scale. Add a bit of hot glue at the bottom if needed to secure the center. Use the tweezers to expand the fringes, then add another 1.8 cm. For the 1.5 cm strip, we're going to bend a third of the paper strip and attach to the center. Finally, we're going to add our last 1.3 cm strip to the center. It should look like this. Now we are going to make some petals. Cut the yellow crepe paper according to the template. Then we are going to color the paper with some orange paint. Do the same to the other side and let it dry completely. Cut the petals according to the template and shape it. First, we twist the top of the petal, then curl the whole petal. After that, we can start attaching the petals onto the flower center. I place the petals with a bit of space in between, so they are not packed together. After the petals, we need to add some small leaves underneath. We are going to attach it with yucca glue and let it dry.
curl the small leaf slightly with the tweezers so it looked more 3D. I have added a few leaves to decorate the stamp. If you want to know more details on making leaves, don't forget to watch our leaf making tutorial. Wrap the leaves onto the stem, then you're done. Thank you for watching the video and I hope you like it. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to our channel. Stay tuned for our weekly tutorials. And all our templates are available on our Etsy store. Check them out as well. See you next week!